What's really good, YouTube? It's your boy Marco. And your girl Q. And we're back again to talk about uh, what's going on out there in the world. Uh, a big concert that happened in the city of Atlanta. You know, we are both residents of Atlanta. Was the Drake and Future concert. Now, y'all know my cheap ass definitely wasn't going to no damn paying no hundred and whatever dollars to see no damn Drake and Future. But Q did. <laughs> Shut so, up. First of all, so I go to most concerts oh and I usually buy them during pre sale, so I get them for a good deal. Oh Thank God. you very much. Oh but I did attend. How much you pay for these things? I don't remember. I bought them They want to know. The people want to know. Pro- they probably were like $160. Oh, hell no. For one ticket? That was, that's not, actually, I've seen these tickets going anywhere from $600 up. So life th- that wasn't bad. Giving them white people your money. I will say, well, Drake is the only white one here. A future is, I don't mind supporting a young black man. Drake is you know whatever but i'm gonna say that that is definitely my last time seeing future this year i have seen future either four or five times i can't even remember this year but i am God. done with mr hendrix so tell me about the concert overall. i really went mainly because i've seen drake um this would be my third time seeing drake overall mm-hmm. but he puts on a really good show as uh-huh. far as production lights and everything like he that. Really a, he Visually, gives you a show. he gives you a show, and mm-hmm. he makes you feel like it's worth everything. I do feel like, um, of all the times I've seen Future in my life, which is probably like twenty, he is stepping his game up with Drake. Now, Future had dancers. He had yeah, okay. Future. He had light effects. Future Future went out this time. Future. It definitely um, wasn't Drake's level. But it definitely was a good show. So Future spending money on his, his he, portion. He damn sure is spending money. Fuck up some commas. He fucking up some commas with this. And uh, from what I heard, that is Drake doing the overall show, and Future comes out for a little set in between for like thirty minutes. So yeah, that's what fucks you up because you kind of think, okay, this is Drake and Future show. So you think Future's opening, uh-huh. Drake's finishing because that's the traditional setup. Well, actually, what happened was Drake comes out. And then he does bring Future in the middle. Future goes on for about, oh, he does a lot of songs. Future did, a, you know, it was a, you can tell that he wasn't just like a featured artist. He did a few songs. And then in between there, then there were some more featured artists. At the Atlanta show, I went to the second show. So there was one on Thursday and there was one on Friday. And I heard the lineup was different. I don't exactly know who was there Thursday. Friday, um, Usher came out, which was really nice. Okay. That was really good. No limit. Yeah, baby. he did that. And that was good to see. I will say Usher is not a young spring chicken anymore. He no, was a little a out of man. breath. That's an old ass man. Yes, he was a little out of breath. Mm-hmm. But you know, he's a hell of a performer. So I fucks with Usher. Okay. Um, and then who else came out? Oh, of course, Young Thug. I am a huge Thug and Thug fan. Young Thug came out? I am a huge Thug and Thug fan. During Drake set or Future set? Did Young Thug come out? Or was that another concert? I know he got a song. I know he got a song. No, Young Thug didn't come. Did he come out? Was that that concert? This nigga right here. This he one did not about. come out. <laughs> not at this uh, summer sixteen concert. I'm sorry. No, he did not. There was somebody else that I just can't remember who else came out. But that was a really good show. The main thing that probably took the cake for this show, for me, visually, was Drake's visuals. He had like wait, 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 wait. lanterns. Didn't Gucci man come out? Gucci came out. That's what is wrong with this nigga? <laughs> and I am a huge Gucci fan. My bad. That's who came out, Gucci, and he looked good. And I, I have not been a really big fan of the new Gucci. I am the old trap house Gucci, but Gucci did great in this performance. He looked good. He looked like he got money. He was doing his doing his thing. He so didn't he, look good. Let me let me talk about this Gucci man coming out because first of all, when you live in Atlanta, you following mostly Atlanta people. You basically at the show too because everybody putting up videos. So right. I was watching the Gucci part when he came out. Gucci. Look like he was turned up. But this is the thing about Gucci. I saw Gucci Man perform back when he was fat as hell. Mm-hmm. So he barely moved around mm-hmm. because he was fat as fuck and he didn't move him. Right. I see his skinny ass on stage barely moving now. Like, what the fuck yeah, is he doing? Yeah, he's kind of stiff and he don't visually got much going on, like, as far as <laughs> no dancers and stuff, which is all cool. No, nah, he's just a guest. He's on some Yeah, he, he, yeah, he, 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 he was just a but guest. My man. whole thing is, move around, nigga. He you lost all that weight. Move around. Y'all niggas is too yeah. 
cool for school, but yeah. you want us to go out and spend our hard-earned money Gucci to fucking that show support up, you. Though. That shit was lit. I know that one part, that last song he performed, Gucci think I love him. Yes, I that was my favorite. That's I, my favorite Gucci song. Boy, I know it was white people in that building like, what the mm. fuck is this? That is my favorite Gucci song. <laughs> I think I love, nigga, you love me? That's my Yo, favorite Gucci song. I already know white people was in there like, what Them who white the fuck folks is was this in guy? There, lit. there was this white boy in front of me that Rap the entire thing, the entire show, from Drake to Future to he sang Usher. The white boy was lit the okay, whole time. Okay. So it was a really good show. That was a good show. They they say when you go to a Drake concert, you might see a fifty year old white man at that mother white you man. You see up there. kids. You see you see whatever Shout uh, out to Drake. at the Drake concert. It, it's everybody All there. Right. So was at the end of the day, your synopsis is was it worth it? It definitely was worth it. Um, Not your damn mind. Again, the visuals. Like, he had these little lantern things that just, like... And I'm a smoker, so, you know, I'm in there high. I'm just amazed out of my fucking mind. Like, I'm just thinking this is the coolest shit ever. So, that was a great concert for me. Um, if you haven't went to the Summer 16 tour and it's coming to your city, I would recommend it to you. Yeah, and it's crazy because it's going for, like, another two months. Yeah, <laughs> they out here. That's crazy. And they added gonna, shows, Rick. Right? Yeah, and it's going to end in Toronto. So yeah. that should be crazy. That's going to be the lit one. one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So anyway, it's your boy Marco. Your girl Q. And just go ahead and, uh, you know, like, subscribe. Uh, leave some comments. If you went to see the Drake concert, let us know what you thought. Who who did he bring out during his set at your concert in your city? Let us know. Queecha going to go ahead and reply because, sure you be. know, what the hell else she going to do? So... Well, one of us will reply. So go ahead and uh, go ahead and leave a comment. Talk to you later. This is.